Spain women boss Jorge Vilda has spoken out in response to the ongoing saga involving Luis Rubiales and Jenny Hermoso. Spain women coach Jorge Vilda has spoken out to condemn RFEF president Luis Rubiales for his inappropriate behavior after kissing Jenny Hermoso in the aftermath of their World Cup triumph. Rubiales has stubbornly refused to resign from his role despite facing widespread calls to step down. With accusations made about his conduct in Australia last week during the team celebrations after beating England 1-0 in the final. Rubiales was spotted grabbing Hermoso and kissing the Spain player in an incident that sent shockwaves through football, with outrage ensuing in Spain over his behavior. Hermoso released a statement on Friday, denying Rubiales' assertion that the kiss was consensual. She also hit out at the Spaniard for making comments that were categorically false and part of the manipulative culture that he has generated. On Saturday afternoon, all 11 members of Vilda's coaching staff resigned in protest, stating that they were forced to attend the aforementioned press conference where Rubiales sensationally chanted that he would not resign. While Vilda did not step down from his post, the World Cup winning coach criticized Rubiales' behavior. A statement read, I deeply regret that the victory of Spanish women's football has been harmed by the inappropriate behavior that are until now top leader. Luis Rubiales has carried out and that he himself has recognized. There is no doubt that it is unacceptable and does not reflect at all the principles and values that I defend in my life, in sport in general and in football in particular. I condemn without doubt any macho attitude, which should be, far from an advanced and developed society. A clearly undesirable climate has been generated, far from what should have been a great celebration of Spanish sport and women's sport. I reiterate my unwavering commitment to promoting a sport that is a model of equality and respect in our society. Despite opposition from Vilda, his coaching staff and other notable figures such as Iker Casillas and David De Gea, the RFEF are continuing to stand by Rubiales after releasing an extraordinary statement on Friday. In responding to accusations made by Hermoso, the RFEF backed Rubiales by insisting the evidence is conclusive that the president did not lie. Instead of targeting Rubiales, the governing body pledged to take legal action against Hermoso, who was part of the side that won the Women's World Cup only last week. However, FIFA have moved to provisionally suspend the 46-year-old after opening disciplinary proceedings against the RFEF Supremo. And it seems he may be about to lose Vilda after he finally broke his silence on the matter.